most important thing to know about the Concept 2 Roar when you're using it is that the tension lever on the flywheel has to be proper for you and for the machine that you're using. Often the user of the Concept 2 Roar will set the tension on the flywheel at 10, thinking they're getting the best workout. This is not actually true. Setting the flywheel at 10 is harder on your body. Most experienced rowers use a flywheel lever setting of three to five. We put the damper at two or one or two or three. Because I'm a lightweight, I have smaller legs, so I'm gonna, it's gonna be less pressure, but it's gonna allow me to bring the stroke rate up faster. The bigger guys will have it higher, they have stronger legs, so they can take advantage of that extra pressure on the stroke. But what's the highest you think somebody, a rower should go with on Four, the damper? Four five max. Actually, the tension that you use is determined by going to the computer. After pressing the menu button, go to the more options screen and press on the display drag factor screen. There are, there are two options on this screen. The first is to d display your drag factor. And the second is to uh, learn more about the drag factor. There are three pages of text on the Concept2 computer I've included those in the back of this video if you want to read uh, more about the drag factor. The best thing to do is hit the, dis the drag factor display button and, to be and begin rowing. This will display your current drag factor at the flywheel lever tension you've selected. I'm going to demonstrate the relationship between the flywheel tension lever and the drag factor and, and how I determine my personal lever position for this machine. If you are rowing between 7 and 10, you'll be surprised at your drag factor. Try different flywheel lever tensions until you arrive at a drag factor between 100 and 140. Rowing at a flywheel lever tension that gives you a drag factor of about 120 will simulate normal rowing and give you a more satisfying workout. I hope this was helpful. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe and press the bell next to the subscribe button and you'll get my future videos. Thanks for watching.